generation of talent one of one LeBron James we know he's on the mission people might not want to talk about it but we already know this is not just the Heat and Lakers this is Pat Riley versus LeBron James and LeBron James really want to win this series in my opinion and then on top of that they have two of the best floor generals to ever play the game of basketball on the court. And that's LeBron James and Ray John Rondo. Self. I don't care I mean, what kind of zone air exposure throw out there. Those guys are able to read it and put their teammates in position to be successful. And I also believe that the depth of Miami bigs is not enough to overpower the Lakers. Bam is special. But what happens if he get in foul trouble? You know, well a punch well a punch coming from the heat in the sport of basketball is their perimeter shooting. It's Tyler Hero who's averaging 19 points a game. It's Duncan Robinson who shot 40% from the three-point range in the Eastern Conference Finals. It's Bam Adebayo who's averaged 22 and 11. And oh, by the way, when he was so dissatisfied and disgusted with his play in Game 5, came out in Game 6 and dropped 32 and 14. It's also the heat collectively having a puncher's chance because they've got this bunker mentality. They know all the odds are stacked against them, and they're, and they're playing with house money. Now, what I do get tired about is these players lying to the American public. Jimmy Butler, nobody picked you to be here. There's two people on this show right now who picked you to be there. It would be Kendrick Perkins and myself. <laughs> we both picked the Miami Heat to be in the finals. So, Jimmy Butler, stop lying to the American public, my brother. We did pick you. It's just that we ain't picking you to win. And yeah, what we yeah, have to look not just like, just go through the history of the league. Not just, you can even go be past the modern era into, like, the pre-three-point shot era. In an NBA season unlike any other, only two teams remain. The Los Angeles Lakers and the Miami Heat have spent 85 straight days on the campus in Orlando, all with one goal in mind, winning an NBA championship. He's the greatest player of his generation, and perhaps the conversation continues about the greatest ever. This would certainly cement his legacy. Our guys have been incredibly locked in. You know, even though we have you know, two superstars, we have to become a team first team. The 2020 NBA Finals are here. How about this crowd in game one of the NBA Finals? There are 17 NBA champions in the virtual fan spots here tonight. We're here, baby. Do what we do, man. Come on, do what we do. Energy, 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 right? Wings, 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 wings! Watch the screen! Watch the screen! One thing about this Heat team, they're not afraid, and it gives them a chance against anybody. Iguodala to Robinson off the screen. Deep corner, far side, bang from downtown. Crowder again. Defensively, let's get after these guys a little bit more than we're doing right now. We're on our heels, waiting for the action to happen. Yeah, everybody pressures right here next time they have the ball. James with the steal, throws it up. Davis back up and this time able to finish. Well, the Lakers starting to heat up. Talk, Black, talk. John Rondo from downtown. The Lakers can't miss from three, and they have their first double-digit lead in the game. Danny Green hits another three-pointer. 11 threes already for the L.A. Lakers. Lakers by 24, Lakers by 26. Anthony Davis has 24, and Eric Spolster needs another timeout. There we go. Not a, a single thing is going right for Miami. Goran Dragic injured his left, left foot. foot yeah. Jimmy Butler's got a sprained left ankle. Bam has got a bad left shoulder. Rondo dribbles into the paint, bounce pass to a cutting LeBron who dunks. Wow, what a dunk. The Los Angeles Lakers take game one of these NBA Finals. A dominant victory led by their two stars. I felt good. Uh, first NBA Finals game. Obviously, the nerves was there. Just a moment I waited for in my entire career. And now I'm here, so, you know, maximize this opportunity because it doesn't come around too often. Oh, good, we 
satisfied. We got it done, we got to keep pushing. This is a seven game series. This is one game. You cannot overreact. We have 48 hours to figure out what the next plan of attack will be. We're much better than we showed tonight. You do have to credit the Lakers and we'll get to work. We knew how hard we had to play if we wanted to try to make it a game. We got so much more work to do. <clears throat> the job is not done. We're not satisfied. We're winning one game. This is when you feel most alive, or when you're being tested competitively. It's supposed to get tougher and more challenging every single round, and may the best team win. For us as a ball club, our mindset is game one is over, and game two we got to be desperate as the opponent. Knowing we're a couple men down, other guys are going to have to step up in a big way. Really, really excited to see how we bounce back. The Lakers are going to be wearing their snake skin print, black bomba uniforms. Anthony Davis said that when they put those uniforms on, they feel like they can't lose. We shine brightest when they got us. Let's yeah. go get it. Let's go get it. Caldwell Pope dives on the floor and saves it. James drives past his side. That's where they're absolutely devastating in transition. That's what we're talking about, right? That's what wins for us. Okay, first to the floor. LeBron dumps it into AD who dunks it. What a nice pass by LeBron. And a great stop by the Lakers. Go, 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 go. Crowder, big find to Crowder. Crowder hard off the glass. Miami is playing exponentially better this game than they did in game one. Butler kicks it out. None wide open. None gets it to go from beyond the yard. And the Heat down by four with five minutes remaining here in this first half. Heat hanging tough here in game two. I need big shots, guys. I need big shots. Great energy. I need a break. Yeah. Okay? We need stops. It's a fast break. Rondo's got it. He brings it quickly into the front court. Alley UK D. Oh, what a pass. And Davis lays it up and in. AD and another basket. He's seven for seven in the third quarter. 15 of his 30 coming here in the third. Keep killing it. Keep killing the glass. Shoots a contested two. No good. Adonis Haslam, the 40-year-old in his 17th year, he of three Miami Heat rings. Took over the huddle with the intensity that we've oh. come to know from Adonis. Olenek now off the dribble, goes right at LeBron James, draws the foul and puts it in. Miami Heat, without Dragic, without Adebayo, made it interesting. James comes up, down to Davis, oh, what a block by Nunn! Kendrick Nunn rejects Anthony Davis! Eric Sposter's got to love the fight in his team. Keep driving it! Keep driving it! LeBron to the rim, throws it up, no good. Rebound, Anthony Davis puts it up, no good. Tipped in by LeBron. Rondo inside to James. James scoops it up and in. 33 for LeBron James. The Miami Heat gave him a test, but the Los Angeles Lakers going to take a two games to none lead in the 2020 Finals. You're wearing a very special jersey tonight, the Black Mambas. You guys are undefeated in those unis. Well, it's always special to be able to represent someone that meant so much. Um, this is what it's all about. We're thinking about uh, the Bryant family, and hopefully we're making them proud. never given up. It's not over. You know, um, we're just down on two. We gotta do something special. We're capable of it. You know, I wouldn't want to be in the trenches with any other guys except for the ones that we have.
It's game three of the NBA Finals and another test for the Miami Heat to prove their resilience. Incredible opportunity in front of us. Our guys are very mentally tough. They love competition. Four teams in NBA history have come back from 0-2 down to win in NBA Finals. So 0-2 is possible. You are incredibly optimistic for someone who is down 2-0. We get one tonight, you might be up to something. Okay. Okay. Versus your Miami. Yeah. And Eric trying to keep this team fired up. Jimmy Butler drives, kicks it inside. Leonard flips it up and in. Good pass, JB. So the Lakers are a little sloppy early. The seal down the other end. They throw it ahead to Butler, and Butler tears it down. And Frank Vogel calls timeout. The Heat playing some terrific inspired basketball here to open up game three. Get stopped and then get out and fly. Heat have to go second quarter. Rondo, alley oop AD, catches it in reverse, dunks it at the rim. That's tough, we'll live. That's okay. Butler down the right wing to be Butler. Butler stops, puts his jump shot up, got it to go. Butler now with 15. Butler's got Caruso on him. Goes right at him and bangs it home. Yeah, JB! Boy, Jimmy Butler has been sensational here in the first half. Miami Heat trying to pull off one of the more surprising results in the finals game in a long time. Crowder throws it ahead to Tyler Hero. Reverse layup. This is the largest lead they've had so far in these finals. Next play. We good. We good. Change the energy out there. Guarded by Agadon. Olenek looking to help. Oh, a shot. It goes. James backs in and just completely pulls his way to the rim. Right there. Laker basketball. Stops deflections. No fouls. And break. Lakers with another opportunity to take the lead. Rondo down the middle. Rondo all the way. Left hand layup by Rondo. It's good, and the Lakers take the lead. This is anybody's game. Who is going to execute down the stretch here at crunch time? Jimmy Butler here in game three. Trying to get Miami in the win column down 0-2. Pass inside to Olenek. Oh, what a feed from Butler. Now it's Butler driving, Butler hanging, Butler hitting a 40-point game three. Triple-double for Jimmy Butler. What an inspiring victory for the Miami Heat. I don't care about a triple, I don't care about none of that, I really don't. I want to win, we did that. I think we realized that we belong. He is an elite, top percentile competitor, and this is top percentile competition that we're facing. One of the best competitors that we have in our game, to be able to focus a fierce competitor like that is something I'll look back on when I'm done playing. I tell coach all the time, I'm ready for this. Like, the biggest stage, whatever you ask me to do, I can do it.